Hi, I'm Rich Smith from Simscape, and I'm here today to talk about the interactive 3D view, plot, and monitor window controls in Cadium. Cadium is our integrated simulation environment for computational fluid dynamics, or CFD. Using the mouse, you can interact with any 3D view, plot, or monitor in Cadium. Let's take a look at each mouse button and how it does this. You can configure the left mouse button according to the interaction chosen on the interaction toolbar shown here. So by default we have spin selected. So for the 3D model that means once we've made the first selection then we keep the button pressed and move and we spin the model around the selection point we just made on the model nearest projected point as you can see for the pan mode again still the left button we pick a point and then move the model parallel to the plane of the camera in the plot window here we can also pan or basically move the existing plots in whatever direction we want using the same pan principle. All right, if we move on to the zoom mode, again, still the left button, once we pick a point in the 3D window and then move up the screen vertically upwards the model moves towards us. Think of the camera going closer to the model. And then when we move vertically downwards, you can see that the model zooms out, i.e. the camera is moving further away. Same kind of principle in the plot window, except that a vertical movement upwards zooms in only on the Y axis. And likewise, if you zoom down in the vertical axis, you zoom out on the y-axis and then if you do a horizontal movement to the right you zoom in on the x-axis and you zoom out by going to towards the left then finally we come to the select mode still the left mouse button and this basically once you st press the button and then move the mouse with the button still depressed you get to select various pieces of the model in 3D and so on. Next we come to the middle mouse button and in this case it is independent of the left button and is always as far as the 3D view window is concerned gives you access to the pan mode as I'm showing here same applies to the plot you use the middle button to pan move the basic plot around as shown here next up we have the scroll wheel and in this case if we scroll away from our hand then we zoom into the model and if we scroll towards our hand we zoom out from the model. During this form of zoom, the focus point is directly underneath the cursor. So if I move the cursor to the front of this car and then use the zoom, the scroll wheel, you can see it focuses on that spot again directly under the cursor. And as I zoom out, you can see it keeps that point. Now, if we move to the plot, we have an another similar mode of interaction we basically push the scroll wheel away from our hand to zoom in and towards our hand to zoom out and notice that this zoom is zooming equally in both directions unlike the fine precision we had on the left button configured zoom where we could control the different zooms in the different directions quite precisely
Okay, the last button on the mouse then is the right button, and this always is wired to be selection or picking. And so I'm pressing it now, you can see it basically picks whatever is under the cursor. As I move the cursor, notice interactively it flips through the geometry in the vicinity as I move. And then once I let go, I get the usual selection dialog to determine precisely which portion of the selection I want. Just want to cover the fit all button on the interaction menu. This basically takes the model you have and whatever view you have and makes sure that the extent of the model fits within the window. Okay, And then same principle for the plot if you've done some pan and zoom and so on and now you want to return to the original view you started with you hit the fit all and there you get your plot back in the same range as you started with. Thank you for watching this screencast on the interaction modes and controls in Cadium. If you want to see some more Cadium and receive a free trial visit simscape.com